Hi, Hiram here. I thought while I had the camera set up and had these stoves out, I might as well do a burn test here. So this is my original fancy feast stove, Zelf's fancy feast stove, and the super light backpacking alcohol stove from eBay. I put 30 milliliters of alcohol in each one of them and they've been sitting here for about five minutes. Let's see what happens when we light them. Oops. Now 30 milliliters might not be enough for some of these, especially I'm not sure how fiberglass works. Okay. All right, what's the deal here? Guess we'll have to get out the big lighter. Now, like I said, 30 milliliters, that's about a half of a fluid ounce. Might be too little for them. It works on mine. I don't know why, I guess because of the carbon felt. But uh, a little bit different there. Okay, so that's the flame test. Now you can see this one, the diameter of the flame is a little smaller, so that might work well for small pots. Again, because mine and Zelf's are made out of cat food cans, so the diameter is larger than the diameter of what this can is. Uh, I'm not saying that's good, bad, or whatever, I'm just pointing it out. Okay. Mine looks like a larger flame than Zelf's, as far as tallness and whatnot. Zelf's is burning a little bit bluer. Of course, this one's been used like a thousand times. I'm being facetious, but a hundred or more times. So this one might be getting a little old and rusty. But, there you go. So that's a flame test on my fancy feast, Zelf's fancy feast, and the super light backpacking alcohol stove from eBay. I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.